It's up for welcome to power play with CJ prospect profiles. They want to focus on Jake Vertinen, a Calgary hitman, one of the top Western League forwards eligible to 2014 NHL entry draft. He's a pretty highly touted kid, going number one in the uh, 2011 um, Western League Bantam draft out of uh, the each was with the uh, Abbotsford Hawks Bantam program. Um, and then you know last year really. I don't say burst on the scene his first full year in the dub, but he had 34 points in 62 games, and I think played better than his stats indicate. Um, I love the way he goes to end up with the puck. Once we talk a lot about that, but I'll have to start with the size, but how he goes to end up with the puck. He's six foot one and about 195 pounds. He's got some growing ahead of him. I think he can possibly top out at being six foot three, you know, 210. I mean, you know, that that's an ideal size. And one thing, like I said, that stands out of him is how he takes the puck to the net with authority. He uses finesse and uh, just brute force to get there. It reminds me a lot um, at the same age of Evander Kane when he was with the Vancouver Giants, was one of the best goal scorers in the Western Hockey League. Uh, going into the 2009 NHL draft, and I'm really not making a comparison between the players, but y you can just see that, and you know, being able to do that at a young age, um, knowing that's where you go, you got to go to the high traffic areas if you want to score goals, and embracing that, and um, you know, not being afraid to you know get their nose dirty and go right to the uh, like I said, the the high traffic, um, you know, the, the danger zones, as, as some people would say. He also had 67 penalty minutes this year, so he's a tough kid. Um, his penalty minutes have been high everywhere he played, and you know that's reflective of a kid that's not going to take any um, take any shift in the opposition and just go out there and play hard every night. And you know that's kind of what you're looking at. And with a good second year in the Western League, I can see him going in the top five or top ten next year. Um, you know, I think he has the potential to score 30, 40 goals next year for the Hitmen, and uh, like I said, be one of the better you know forwards in the in the dub next year. And I think that those steps forward in development and you know improving improving upon. Um, his first season would, would definitely serve him well in the eyes of scouts and um, you know NHL talent evaluators and all that. I think that'll be um, that'll be something to watch. You know, like I said, I'm intrigued by his size. He's compared himself to Rick Nash, and um, you know I can kind of see that a little bit. You know, like like I said, you know Nash goes to the net with you know both brute force and uh, finesse. You know, he can he can dance through guys, and I think Brandon can do it to a certain degree from what I've seen of him. He, he can do it. Um, it's just a matter of you know can that translate to the next level. And, um, you know, watch him fill out his size, be something to watch and uh, take on a, a bigger leadership role with uh, the Hitmen next year. So he, he's a definitely got to watch and a guy that's going to be moving up draft boards all throughout next season, I think. Anyway, that's one episode of the Power Play with CJ Prospect Profiles on Jake Verton and a Calgary Hitmen. Stay tuned for more episodes throughout the offseason and beyond. Later, guys.